Hello guys, who's watching this video and in this video I would like to show you how to handle dummy variables from the raw data and let's go to the example and for example we have uh, this kind of data frame uh, we have a data set and as you can see we have uh, one two three four five six seven columns and from this data we have a uh, the first column is numerical data the second one is categorical data numerical numerical categorical numerical and also categorical and our task is to create demo variables from categorical data and to create demo variables for uh, type for color and for happy and in the result we will have more than seven columns for, uh, because we have a different uh, values for each category for example type we have food technology hours and books and from this column we have to have a uh, one two three and four extra columns so let's do it and for this task we will use only pandas library no sql learn no any anything extra no any special libraries just pandas and so let's import pandas library and the second step is to get our data set from the csv file let's do it yes it's the same as we had in excel so so far it's looking fine and now the tricky part uh, tricky part is here uh, we will write a special function that will handle our uh, that will handle our, our categor categorical data and uh, I will write this function in order to uh, adopt this function to each data frame with minimum uh, manual work so let's do it and the idea is like that we import uh, our raw data frame and we create a different subsets for dummies for example dummies uh, type equal to we create a dummy types for this column for type so dummies type uh, uh, Okay, we will use pandas uh, with pandas and get dummies method pandas and argument will be uh, a column type uh, the second argument is prefix Let's say, let's say it's type again and the third argument this will be a request to drop first column drop first equal to true because after uh, after we create the demi variables uh, it means that we create extra columns for each each type for each category we have to remove original one because it is not necessary because we extract this uh, column to different columns for each uh, category so the original one is doesn't matter and it's very useful for machine learning purpose we have because we have to have only representative uh, and very structured uh, data frame for your machine learning project so and let's do the same with all category columns now we have the second one is a color color let's let's set the prefixes uh, C the third uh, category categorical column is happy yes it's happy happy and 
let's, let's set the prefix is h and also to draw first for each column is true and the next step in this function is as I told before is to drop original columns Origi is to drop original category columns and data frame drop type color and happy okay uh, so far it's looking so nice and the code is so clear so we have to think what you have to return so we have a free subset of data for dummies and we have original data frame when we dropped uh, categorical columns and we have to return a, a merged data frame from different subsets and for this we'll use a, a for this we'll use a concat method in pandas so let's do it pandas concat and the first uh, thing what we have to merge is the original data frame the, but remember you remove the original categorical columns from your original data frame so we need to, we need to concat the first one and also that means type that means color and that means let's guess what is here happy happy okay I, I hope it will be no any errors okay one last thing let's let's set the axis is one axis is one because we have to conquer it, uh, based of columns and okay one thing that I forgot is to set the axis here because because we have to remove uh, the columns with these names and in place equal true because if we want to uh, keep the uh, index values untouched so perfect no any errors and okay let's see how our data frame will look after handled uh, dummy variables remember we have this one and in the, in the results we'll have very structured data frame uh, with dummy variables and as you can see the type food type hours type technology we have three columns color green color red we have two columns and for happy we have only one column for yes and maybe you ask me why we have only the one column for happy uh, because we have a two categories for happy because we drop the first column because all as i said before we have to produce a representative data frame for machine learning project and this is all for this video uh, thank you for watching it was a little test see you on the next videos bye bye